Quick video about the 6CIT test or 6 item cognitive impairment test when you're looking at assessing things like cognition. Now there are 6 questions that you need to ask. The maximum score you can get is 28, but you're looking for as low a score as possible. So question 1, what is the current year? You get 0 if you get the answer right, 4 if you get the answer wrong. Number 2, what is the current month? Again, 0 if you get the answer right, 3 this time if you get the answer wrong. Number three is address recollection. So you've got to give them an address with five components in and you ask them at the end whether they can recall that address. An example of the five components are John Rose, 36 Finch Street, London, and your marks are given according to how many errors you make. If you make no errors when you recall it, you get zero. If you make five errors, you get 10, and obviously you go down in between accordingly. Question four, about rough, well, what time roughly is it according to the nearest hour? If you get it right, it's zero. If you get it wrong, it's three. Number five, can you count backwards from 20 to one? If you get it completely correct, it's zero. If you make one error, it's two. If you make more than one error, then you get four. And number six, can you count the months backwards? So December back to January. Again, if you get it completely right, it's zero. One error is two and more than one error is four. Now you're looking for a score of zero to seven to say it's a normal result. Once you get eight or above, it's starting to suggest cognitive impairment. So six CIT, six questions, maximum 28, looking for a score of seven or below. It's the Kingshill Virgin 2000. You can look that up on the internet. Hope this helps.